kindly take the floor. Mr. Vice President, the Vienna Declaration and Program of Action stresses the importance of eliminating gender bias in the administration of justice. Criminal laws are an essential part of combating violence against women. The past few years have seen positive steps for women's human rights. Croatia and Mongolia criminalized domestic violence. Tunisia, Lebanon, Jordan, and Morocco repealed laws that allowed a rapist to escape impunity if he married his victim. These are welcome developments toward promoting women's access to justice and safety. But we must safeguard against stagnation and rollbacks that threaten the positive strides made around the world. When criminal laws discriminate against women or impose barriers in their access to justice, they perpetuate gender bias against women. Russia, for example, decriminalized domestic violence last year. Now, battery of a close person that results in physical pain but does not inflict harm or other consequences is no longer a crime. While Hungary has domestic violence laws, it requires at least two acts of domestic violence to occur within a short time frame to trigger criminal liability. To promote implementation of the Vienna Declaration, states must commit to ongoing legal reform. The Advocates for Human Rights calls on member states to adopt laws in line with international standards to protect victim safety and promote offender accountability. Domestic violence should be a crime with penalties that are commensurate or greater to than other violent crimes, and system professionals must undergo trainings conducted in consultation with NGOs that best know victims' needs. Thank you. Thank you very much.